witness the wetness. This is Innuendo Bingo. Oh, uh, yeah. Yes. Today, Joe Jonas and his band DNCE are an army against Chris Stark on Innuendo Bingo. If you're watching this now, which you can on the radio and website, it's just four of them staring into his eyes, and they mean business. It's intimidating. Look at them. Look at them. Mm-hmm. Okay, it's good to have Bingo back on. So, um, the guys know the score within Yuda Bingo. They've watched the previous video, so the aim is to really just get him. No um, problem. Well, yeah, yeah and vice fine. versa. Uh, and vice versa, obviously. Chris is uh, wearing the the apron kindly donated to him by uh, Cole from the band, which now says Hoots on it. Um, obviously, <laughs> no brand names allowed here. Uh, so we've got a clips, uh, some clips from uh, various TV and radio shows, which sound a bit rude, but obviously aren't. That's why it's called Innuendo Bingo. So if you could all grab your waters, please, mm. and let's do this game. DNC like? Innuendo Bingo, starting now. Right. Watch us on your phone, on the radio and right, website. Okay. This is happening. Fully in vision. Fine. Are you okay, Ginger? You ready? We're just drinking, right? Just, drink, oh. just hold it in your mouth, just like... A fair bit, I would say. Like, fill your cheeks. Don't be shy. <laughs> First of all, it's Sally Morgan, and she's on BBC Radio Cumbria. Now, I've not seen Sally's listening figures, but with, with daily offers like this, I imagine they're probably through the roof. Uh, and we'd love to hear from you, as I say, whether, you've, uh, whether you just want to unload. Feel like unloading? You unload on me. That's absolutely fine. It's a, it's a slow start, but I know this is going to build. Mm. That's good. Oh. Sally Morgan on BBC Radio Cumbria. And remember Sally's motto. <laughs> Feel like unloading? You unload on me. That's absolutely fine. Thank you to James <laughs> for spotting that one. Oh, this is going to get wet. OK. Fill your mouths with water, please. Mm. Let's get wet. Now it's over to Test Match Special on Five Live Extra. Now, I don't really understand much about cricket, but I think I maybe need to watch a little bit more with stuff like this happening. It must be foggy in Abu Dhabi because they're all tweeting away. Lee West was just tweeting, so they uh, need to get the cock out now. He's uh, swinging far too hard. <laughs> <laughs> didn't, you, didn't you just fell off the seat there? OK, that's good. That was a, oh, come on. That was a, a storm there for Chris, a tropical storm in his face. Um, talking about South African oh. professional cricketer Quinton de Kock there, of course. <laughs> and uh, busy game for him. Need to get the cock out now. He's uh, swinging far too hard. <laughs> Cheers to George and Brighton and also Duncan and Beck for that one. Water, please. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, I've missed this game. Mm-hmm. Now we're going over to BBC London Weather. Forecaster Darren Betts is telling us all about the plans of the news presenter Alice. Darren seems to know quite a lot about Alice. Obviously, he's been on a night out with her before. We've got this cloud over us right now. We're going to find some spells of rain. Could be a short, sharp burst of rain. Looks like uh, Alice is going to get wet when she's out clubbing tonight. (laughs) (laughs) Oh! Oh! That was a good one. Yeah, Darren knows a lot about Alice there. It looks like uh, Alice is going to get wet when she's out clubbing tonight. Yep. <laughs> Water, please. <laughs> I feel you're getting away with it at the back there, though. Mm. You know? It's OK, though. That time will come. No. Yes, Joe? <laughs> Joe's going to give what, up his what seat. Gentleman. What a gentleman. What a gentleman. Water, please. Mm-hmm. Hey, don't forget about Sally, by the way. Feel like unloading? You unload on me. That's absolutely fine. Sorry, Sally there. <laughs> Sally's motto in life. <laughs> oh, it went... oh. Oh. What's happened, Chris? Sorry, I'm not used getting used to this game again. Okay. Okay. Oh, I dropped my censorship as well. I'm... Was it Hoot or Hers that was, was covered hoots. up before? It was it just said Hoot, yeah, so uh, yeah, just hoot. Yeah, that yeah, was gonna happen cool. when it got wet. Cool. Okay, cool. So uh <laughs> reload, reload with water please. Mm-hmm. Now over to one of Britain's best love soaps, ITV's Coronation Street. Poor Mary is not having a good time, but things are looking up. It is not a caravan. It's a motorhome for your information, and I don't live in it anymore. I don't live anywhere anymore. What's that, Mary? Oh, nothing a milky coffee and a nice finger can't sort out. (laughs) (laughs) 
finger what? <laughs> <laughs> it's just uh, she was gonna have like oh, uh, wow. like a little chocolate <laughs> finger there and a nice <laughs> a nice cup of tea. That's what we do in Britain. Oh, nothing a milky coffee and a nice finger can't sort out. Mike in Warsaw and John from Leek found that one for us. Oh wow. Now these are great clips today. How are you feeling, Chris? Pretty wet down oh, there? Pretty wet. I think we're all getting a bit yeah. Yeah. wet around here. Um, mm. Might need some more water. OK, we have more waters down there, so we're, we're good to go, OK? Oh, yeah. Cool. Now we're going to Dickinson's Real Deal on oh, ITV. Man. Now, I have no idea what antiques expert Alison is looking at, but neither her or contestant Christine can quite believe their eyes. And I can also see from here, um, although there's no pontal mark, that this is hand-blown. And you would have had to have quite a long... No, I can't imagine brailing no. something that no, size. No, it, it would have been huge. <laughs> 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 she just can't imagine it. Can't imagine it. I can't imagine blowing something that no, size. No, it would have been huge, wouldn't mm. it? Mm -hmm. Yes, it would. Thank you, Sean and Tyler and Victor from Bath for sending that in. <laughs> oh, are you guys enjoying the game? <laughs> There's probably nothing like this on American radio, I'm, I'm guessing. No. Okay, next to deal or no deal. Reload your water. Lots of it, please. Now, the presenter, Noel Edmonds, has been presenting this show so long that he isn't afraid to share with viewers exactly what the contestants are going through. Please, have the 750. Oh! You've given yourself an amazing climax. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, this is nuts. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, Noel knows oh. exactly what they're going through. You've given yourself an amazing climax. Thank you, Richard and Huddersfield, for spotting that one. OK, we've got a couple more. Oh. Let's make them wet ones. <laughs> no one should be this wet this uh, time of the week. It's Joe Jonas and DNC Innuendo Bingo. You can still watch on the Radio 1 website. Next, it's Mary Berry on the Sport Relief Bake Off. Do you have Bake Off in America? It's a massive show here. It's, uh, yeah, it's people making cakes big. Mm. And here Mary is particularly impressed with what funny man Jason Manford has laid out in front of her. I think it's rather a practical shape that I think people could copy because you've got something to hold at the end yes. and pop it in your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know Mary Berry? <laughs> She's like a, a, a national treasure here. I, I like her it. already. Yeah, yeah. yeah, you would love her. Get into Mary, like Google Mary Berry when you come out of here. I will. She'll be your new favourite. You've got something to hold at the end and pop it in your mouth. She's not normally that dirty. Uh, lots of people sent that in, including Michelle in Air and James in Worcestershire and Dan and Matt and Esme from Nottingham and Callum in Birmingham and Charlie in Warwickshire and Becky. And finally, over to Channel 5. Let's make the last one the West. Mm -hmm. Jason Bradbury is out and about and can't quite believe what's on offer so early in the morning. You can find the latest versions of classic toys here, as well as some of the newest innovations. There's everything here from miniature horses, drones, hoverboard thingies, even men with large balls. <laughs> <laughs> and that was DNCE, Innuendo Bingo. Oh, Go and get yeah. their song, it's good, it's called Cake by the Ocean, and they were great sports today on Innuendo Bingo. Well played.